Romans 8, 28 says that all things work together for good to those who love God and are called according to his purpose. And then verse 29 says, those whom he foreknew, he predestined to be conformed to the image of his son. So you have to read verse 28 and 29 together because God's saying in his word that he works all things together for good. Verse 29 defines what good is, and that's being conformed, being made like Christ. So when we say, how is God working this trial in my life for good? He's working it for good because in that hardship, he's trying to help you if you allow him to make you look more like Christ. So something that could look like a tragedy is actually a triumph if you look at it in light of eternity that this thing in my life is actually humbling me, making me more like Christ, helping me to depend on God in suffering like never before. Because you get to know God the most in suffering. In Philippians 3, it says, I want to know him and the fellowship of his sufferings and the power of his resurrection. So don't despise the trial, but look to God in that trial to make you more like him.